Next, I'd like to introduce um, Mr. Barrett. He'll speak be, uh, on behalf of Sam Smith. I'm Mr. Barrett. I'm going to try and do this without glasses. I saw Mr. Miller's wearing glasses too. I don't feel as bad. <laughs> Little readers. Um, so Sam Smith, a lot of you probably know Sam Smith already, um, including Mr. Miller here, who's covering the event because Sam works with Loveland Magazine as a, uh, well, I'd say a professional writer, photojournalist, videographer, has uh, op-ed columns within the uh, paper too. Maybe you haven't agreed with some of his opinions, but he voices them very well, I think. <laughs> and he's a very considerate young man, so I think he is a, uh, a very good writer to do something like that, share his opinions in a public paper, public paper like that. Um, so anyway, I met Sam as a sophomore. He won the uh, photo contest here at the high school, and a lot of the students even thought maybe the photograph was a professional photograph that he just kind of threw in the contest or something. But uh, he's just that good. When I went to talk to him, he said, yeah, is this camera, this aperture, this lens, this everything? And that was the first time I had talked to him. I was like, oh, OK. <laughs> well, make sure you take photography, and we'll see you in the future. So he did. Unfortunately, I did not have him, but Ms. Woodruff did. I had him in uh, Photo 2, and Mrs. Grant now has him in uh, AP Art. He's uh, done chamber orchestra as well. And the LHSNN, he is our editor and sometimes uh, reluctant uh, anchor. <laughs> he prefers to be behind the camera. Um, so hopefully you've enjoyed his work with the, uh, the LHSNN as well. So as I said, he's worked for Loveland Magazine. He also is a freelance photographer, so he shoots his own portraits and uh, I think maybe even does events, but he does a lot of senior portraits and things like that. So if you need a, just give him a call. Um, he has so many awards, I'm just gonna highlight a couple of these things so you have kind of an idea of uh, some of Sam's accomplishments. Um, he's a three-time winner of the LHS photo contest, so that's the biggest one. All these other ones don't really matter too much. <laughs> um, he also won the uh, visual arts category in the Overture Awards in 2016 as a sophomore, which is enormous and almost unheard of. Uh, he was a semifinalist in the following years in 17 and 18, also very impressive. Uh, student winner since 2016 in the Montgomery Photo Show, which is our Montgomery here in town. Best of show in that contest in 2017. Um, best cinematography in multiple film festivals, so I'll just crunch all those in there. There's a big one, the All-American High School Film Festival, which takes place in New York City, which he went to and uh, with, which this is kind of cool too. He's part of a film culture here at LHS, and they all kind of went to this competition. And uh, Sam was very, uh, influential in creating that culture. Dean Parker was another one that uh, was very much a uh, part of that too. But back to the contest here, he, uh, what were you got here? Official, official selection in 2016, and he was a cinematographer for four official selections out of five total from Cincinnati. So that's enormous as well, and nominated for best cinematography. In 2017, best direction at the same film festival, and then on to a couple more here. National Film Festival of Talented Youth. That's another very large one in 2016. He had an official selection there. And of course, he started the uh, film club here, which hopefully somebody will carry on in his uh, honor there and uh, keep that up because it's a really nice club here at the high school. Um, of course, he wants to be a filmmaker and specialize in cinematography. And not to mention the fact that he received a full tuition scholarship to NYU School of Art, the Tisch School of Art. So, congratulations to Sam Smith. <laughs> 